to hold him in the okay. but I don't want to miss this. <laughs> okay, ready? Yes. Okay. Hi guys, I'm Lauren Zima for Easy Online. I'm here with lovely Amber Rose. How are you? You're looking amazing. I'm good, thank you. You look amazing also. Well, I noticed you're wearing your sunglasses. I am. That is what you're here at Kids for today. Tell me about why you wanted to do an eyebrow. Well, I always wanted to do an eyebrow. Oh, okay. Oh, you got it locked in my hole. And I've always looked for like oh, that is that I would never find, so I decided to myself. Well, cool. yeah, because I remember we talked to you a couple months ago and you were wearing really cool glasses then. What was kind of your mindset in creating the line? What what looks or colors were you going for? Well, I mean, if you see the line, I did uh, red on red, gold on gold, silver on silver, and a lot of lines don't actually have that. And um, I think that they like, you know, they go with a lot of jewelry and um, it's just, like one solid color. So, um, like I said, I've been looking for that for so long, so I decided to just do it. <laughs> just do it yourself. Yeah. If you can't find it, just do it. That's it. <laughs> and I might step a little bit just to make sure we get a clear shot of you. Okay. That's if I'm moving weird. Um, so, yeah, so you are a working mom. Your son is so cute. Thank you. Has being a mom influenced your career choices at all these days? Um, I guess it makes me work harder because I am a mother, but as far as um, me just being myself, um, I, I feel like as a mother you always you want to do what's best for your kids, but you can never ever lose yourself in the midst of that. Yeah. Yeah, and you are, what I love about you is you are always yourself, yeah. 100%. Um, I know you've been working on the Amber Rose Slip Walk, yes. which is amazing, and getting donations from that. Yeah. How, how is planning that going? How's it been? Um, I put a lot of time and effort into the slut walk. I'm very passionate about it. Um, for people that don't know exactly what it is, it's for uh, slut shaming, victim blaming, rape, sexual assault. And I feel like a lot of women go through that or scared to talk about it. And this is bringing awareness to a lot of men and women um, that it actually happens every single day. And it has happened to me on so many different levels. So I'm really passionate about it. It's October 3rd in downtown LA and I hope you can come. <laughs> I, it, I, well, what I love about you, again, is it's for this great cause, but you're making it so fun. You're making it an exciting thing for people well, to be Well, I mean, my, per, my personality is fun, so I, I definitely, you know, I am a feminist, but I feel like a lot of slut walks are extreme feminism, which is a beautiful thing. They definitely inspired me, but I do want my slut walk to be more of like a celebration of women. Yeah, totally. And um, you've getting, been getting some donations and support from like Nick Cannon and other people. Yeah, how does that feel to be able to see that people are supporting you in the celebrity community too? Well, I think that they, uh, I think a lot of people didn't fully understand it at first and now they get it and they, um, like Neo, Nicki Minaj, Nick Cannon, um, all of my Rosebuds out there that donated $10, 5 $20, you know, any little pocket changes they had. Um, because they really do believe in me and they believe that there needs to be awareness. So um, I appreciate everyone that donated. It's amazing. Yeah. Um, anybody who surprised you, like came out of the woodwork with a donation that surprised you? Um, it, actually, if you look on the website, there's a lot of like anonymous donations that are like $1,500, uh, $2,000. I know who they are. <laughs> But a lot of people don't know who they are, but it's cool. I mean, you know, they get it. They didn't have to put their name up there. As long as they support the cause, that's all that matters. Awesome. Um, and I want to ask you a little more about career stuff because there are rumors. You brought Black China here today. and there's My some, bestie. Yes, yes. There are some rumors you guys might have a reality show in the works. So what's going on there? Well, my production company, Behind Her Shades, has a deal with MTV. So that's all I'm going to say. <laughs> She's giving us a little tease. Okay, fair enough. Um, I would love to see you on a reality show. You're so fun. What, what would a reality show with Amber Rose be like? I don't know. I, don't, I guess like people assume that I'm uh, stuck up in bougie sometimes. I guess I, I see like tweets like that, but I'm actually just a down-home Philly girl. Um, I work really hard. I raise my son. I like to have fun. And um, and China's like she's my bestie, so uh, I guess it's all like together. We have a lot of stuff in common too. So if we decide to do a reality show, then that's what it would be. Yeah, like you said, raising your son. You guys are both working moms, yeah. which is great. How is co-parenting going? Because I know you know you and Wiz get along pretty well. How, yeah, how what's co-parenting like? Um, it's pretty easy. You know, we both have our son, and we live down the street from each other. So it kind of makes it like really easy to. Um, work around each other's schedules because we both don't work a nine to five. Um, we kind of work like 24 hours a day, but we also make a lot of time to spend with our baby because we love him so much. So it's pretty easy. 
He is so cute and so smart. He's like a little, I watch your videos on Instagram. He's this little man, the way he talks. He is. He's so cute. Um, and we just had a little bit of drama at the airport, which I love. He's always outspoken about it. Did you hear from him on that or what happened Of course. There? <laughs> I called him immediately. I'm like, what the hell is going on? But um, I, I, you know, as the mother of his child and his ex-wife, you know, I, I obviously still care about it. So when I see stuff like that, I'm just like, it was just ridiculous. I mean, there isn't a law that you can't ride them. You know, so for for a police officer or police officers to manhandle him like that, and I know him. I know how his arms move. I know all that stuff. He wasn't resisting. They just want to make it seem like that, and um, it actually really hurt my feelings watching that. But he's good. Yeah, he's good. He's He's a tough guy, he's fine. Yeah, I, I love again that he made a little joke about it. He said something like, I haven't been in cuffs for a while or right. something. Right. Um, and you, you know, again, what I love about you is you're always up for having fun. And again, I want this reality show to happen because it would be amazing to watch. There was a rumor that you were at James Harden's birthday party earlier this week with like fireworks. Us Weekly said you were there. Were you there? What? Yeah, they said you were there. Why would I be at his birthday party? <laughs> <laughs> That's just a fake rumor that people want to believe, but it is not true. Yeah. I was probably either working or home with my son. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> the rumor has been abolished. She was not there. I was not there. <laughs> I don't know where they got that story from, but I was not there. I, we wondered if you weren't because people were reporting, but we didn't see in pictures or anything. That doesn't even make sense. Yeah. I don't. I don't even know why they would even assume that. <laughs> Stupid. Would Would there be? Well, because are you and James friends, or would there be a reason for you to be there? I, there would be no reason to be there. But me and James are cool. But you know, he's in a really, when you get into a relationship, it's not like we're gonna talk on the phone every day. But um, you know, I'm cool with everybody. Yeah. Well, and what, uh, the last time that you talked to us, I remember you saying like, look, there, yeah, I mean, yes, there's rumors and there's talk that I'm not cool with the Kardashians or whatever. And you were like, I wanna put that aside. I don't wanna I don't deal want to with that. Talk okay, cool. Um, so yeah, getting back to your son a little bit. Again, he's such a cute little man, um, and I think he, he this is. Sorry, bro. She's so good at it. Hey. Sorry. Like. Um, until then, I feel like if I can just help other women get through um, what they've been through, then that can also help me get to the next level. Um, and just one last fun question. You can see yourself in this wig. Thing. You looked amazing. Um, are, you, are you growing the hair out? Are you just playing with No, I'm bald headed forever. <laughs> I'm not growing my hair. I was just, I was actually playing in China's wig closet. She has a whole closet of wigs, so. I was at her house and I threw it on. I'm like, you know, a little selfie in the mirror, but no, I'm bald head scallywag forever. <laughs> okay, on that note, we will wrap it up. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you. And just so people know a little more about the eyewear line, where can they get it now? Obviously, it's a Kitson, but anywhere else. Yes, it's um, www.amberroseeyewear.com. And um, also go to amberroseslutwalk.com and volunteer if you're in the LA area. Donate no matter where you are in the world for the cause. I'm trying to have this slut walk in different cities every single year. So this year is LA. So if you can come out and you live in LA, October 3rd, um, and follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Awesome. Cool. Thank you so much. Thanks, Amber. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I, I, every time I interview, I've never interviewed someone with so many cameras before, so this is a good moment. What do you need? She's Anna? over there somewhere. somewhere. Huh? What, I'm sorry, I thought you needed something. Oh, that's fantastic. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. All right, we need, we want clear. Oh, watch out, Kelly. Are we good? Are we good? Lauren, are you good here? Thank you, Lauren. Appreciate you. Thank you, Walter. No worries.
So is it true that you guys are going to have a reality show? You can't talk about it right now? You can't, okay. So maybe, maybe not. So are, you, so are you guys involved in the uh, sunglasses line together? No, it's just Amber's. It's just Amber's, okay. Okay, what have you been up to lately? What have I been up to? I actually launched my liquid lipstick line today. Oh, okay, where can people get that? Online. Online, okay. Is there? Is it like a, 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 is it like a website? Website, yep. Lashbar.com. Okay, cool. Oh, yeah, I think you've had that for a while. You know, skincare, makeup, eyelashes, all that. Yeah, I think I've seen on Instagram you have quite a few businesses that you've talked about. I have 88 Fin. I have an okay. um, eyelash bar too. Oh, okay, okay, okay. That's really cool. Um, what, uh... I forgot what I was going to ask you. <laughs> I know all this beauty. No. <laughs> you got me forgot what I was going to no, say. No, you're so sweet. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. That's enough, babe. You took a lot, honey. It's like too close to my face. I'm sorry. Okay. Sue, I got my phone right. Kill him. 
Oh. You lucky I'm taking. I'll take, <laughs> I'll take that right out the door. I'll put that right in my kitchen bag. <laughs> Right home with me. <laughs> I can't afford it though. <laughs> <laughs> I can't put it. Shout out to my boss, bitches, bitches. So I was like in the now about okay. bell bottoms being in. But once I saw J Lo with them bell bottoms, I was like, look. Off the door. I had to go get yeah, a pair. Hey, it looked good. No. Look good. J Lo, oh my god. You made a good choice. better on you. <laughs> What's your least favorite modeling pose? Pose? Yeah, so like a stupid modeling pose. No one else is going to wear it. This. <laughs> the basic. Uh, That's it. <laughs> how, how, Take it back to middle school. How long yeah. did it take you to get all your tattoos? Like your the last one that you got, how long mm, did it take? Like four years. Oh, four years? I have to four. mentally prepare myself. Oh, for a Yeah, for the, I for can't the pain. go in. Right. You get it. Tattoos you have. Let's see. I have pieces. Let me see. I have one, two, three, four, five, five pieces. Which one hurt them the worst? I would say the one on my, my rib right here. This one. <laughs> you Which one's your favorite? Uh, my cover up. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I got you. <laughs> oh, wait, it's a good one. It serves its purpose. Sorry. Thank you very much. Okay. It's kind of like a commercial for her. Cool. You have to put them on. I want to, I kind of like want you to show the glasses. Okay. How's that? That's cute. Maybe a little bit higher. So right there. <laughs> Pretty smile, real Should commercial. Should I have them closed? Maybe closed might be better. Real commercial smile. Colgate commercial. Love you, baby. Awesome. That's the type. Oh, my cheese. Huh? <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Nothing. Can I slide this way? Nothing. Nothing. So, uh, this first one is faces. I'm close on the glasses. Trying to put your glasses on. Give me glasses. Yeah. Give us some glasses. Give me glasses. That's what we hear. You don't want to come on. Come on. Make me this one. Okay. It's cool. That's nice. Beautiful, awesome. Last one, this is fashion, head to toe. Y'all can do whatever you want. Love y'all. Thank you. She has both of them. I love that. Let's cool shit. I'm with these. Yeah. Thank you. 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 Thanks for coming out, Amber. Oh, thanks. Thanks for coming <laughs> too. I appreciate it. You should come out in West Hollywood every day. Thank you so much, Amber. Bye. Bye. Let's go.
No, it's just that if the guy we get next has a lot of money and a huge well, dick. Well. That's what it's all about, okay. Mother gets back. So I just need to work on the money thing then, okay, okay. Ooh, excuse you. Okay, so uh, yeah. are your kids going to be on a potential, if you have this reality show, are your kids going to be on it? We don't have, who told you that? I mean, but if, if just hypothetically speaking, if you ever do, knowing be, all you know about it. open books. You'll be open books. For sure. Okay. Okay. Thanks for coming, you guys. Thank, Thank you. you. Thanks, China. Have a good day. Thank you, babe.
they go again. Yeah. Thank you, China. Have a good night. Thank you. Thank you. Look great. Thank you. Thank you, Amber. Have a good night. All right, take care, you guys. Good luck with the sunglasses, Lon. They look great.